This is a foot able to think of it as the proportion of cases where B is true among all possibilities times the proportion of those where A is also true, the probability of A given B. These are both the same, and the fact that they're both the same gives us a way to express P of A given B in terms of P of B given A, or the other way around. So when one of these conditions is easier to put numbers to than the other, say, when it's easier to think about the probability of seeing some evidence given a hypothesis rather than the other way around, this simple identity becomes a useful tool. No, the probability of A is not always equal to the probability of B.